Hello, hello, uh, Simple Culture fans. Welcome back um, to our kitchen. And I hope you had a wonderful, wonderful uh, festive season and happy new year to you. Uh, today, we are back in the kitchen. We are going to prepare stewed um, kariba brim. And I've already prepped it, uh, cleaned, washed and i've cut it into pieces um and what i'm going to use for this recipe is uh my tomatoes um i have my cooking oil i also have onion uh paprika which is optional as well as my pinch of salt so for this recipe it's a slow cooking uh, recipe and I have preheated my pan so first things first I have to put uh, the cooking oil and then start with the onion so I prepare a soup first before uh, adding the, the fish so like I said this is a slow cooking method uh, it's a stewed fish that I'm preparing but I have to make sure that I reduce the heat as I'm preparing it so I add my salt my teaspoon of salt Things like this side is too much heat on this side. Let me add and I have to leave this uh, to cook slowly. Uh, if you're using the conventional stove, then uh, I would recommend you put this on, uh, I'd suggest uh, two or three uh, and give it like three, four hours to do the slow cooking. Let me change the program. I'm new to this kind of a induction stove, so please bear with me because I can see the heat is not uh, nicely uh, distributed. So 
so you really need to minimize turning the fish uh, as you prepare this the heat is too high let me see how i can fix this because it's supposed to be cooking slowly So this is where we are now, um, I think approximately two hours on low heat, this is our fish, I'm just going to add um, child's leaves just to garnish the dish but otherwise our dish is done and this is how you prepare um, stewed fish should fish the Zimbabwean way slow heat uh, low heat and yeah we don't put a lot of spices in Zimbabweans like I said before so thank you for watching and I hope you join us in the next one let me dish this So this is our final product, this is our Kariba brim, stewed, uh, slow cooked, um, and thank you for watching, um, thank you for subscribing and hope to see you in the next one.